Parikrama will be working with three different sets of collaborators, totaling over 60 performers in all. I'm Kamal Guru. I teach music at Gandhi Ashram School. Parikrama is one of the best bands in India. And for us, it is a matter of pride, you know, for us, for the school, for the students. It, it's, it's, it's a doorway, you know, it's a new experience for all of us to play with the Parikrama. My name is Shane William Savian. I've been now 23 years in this institution. This will be the 13th year with this choir. It's been a passion of mine. Today is a huge milestone in the school uh, to collaborate with Parikrama. The Ganjan Deoghar is a Tibetan performing arts group whose patron is the Dalai Lama. It was established in 1994 and aims to preserve the Tibetan heritage of song, dance and music with performances all over the world. I'm Jigmi, Jigmi Wangchuk, and I teach, in, I teach Tibetan in English school. Uh, me, my name is Samdu and I teach here in Ganjan Deoghar. This is an institute uh, of uh, performing arts. Anjong Dega was established in 1994 and uh, since it has been established, we have performed everywhere in the world. So actually we have a school, it's called ITBCI, which is Hindu Tibet Buddhist Cultural Institute. All the students from different, different schools, they have a proper class, they have a language class, singing, dancing, everything. What these kids probably don't realize right now is that them being a part of the song lends so much of innocence to the whole track. But it rains. <laughs>
gonna part of things tucked away safe in my mind A little goodbye maybe or just a passing smile The birds fly away to the southern sky searching All the music came together so well, you know, and uh, it really, really got that, you know, the childhood excitement in me, you know, I was very, very excited this whole tour, you know, working out the stuff with all the parts with these kids and all amazing stuff. It has been a journey of firsts, you know, in a way that the first time we collaborate with kids like this to sing like 30, 40, 50, 60 of them to sing with us on one of our songs. Now, symphonic orchestra made up entirely of children you know belonging to this ashram and that was again a first and to bring out results like the way they did I guess more than 
the level of happiness that they had the level of excitement and joy that we got from collaborating with them was much higher